I'm saying is that the city is printing up its AIDS prevention pamphlets again. That money would be much better spent on a more aggressive campaign where we institute a needle exchange program. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Will you stop with the needles? <laughs> Look, nobody gets upset when you hand out pamphlets because it's almost impossible to inject narcotics with a pamphlet. <laughs> Savings to the city and hospital-related costs I, I would... Can't, I can't do it, Carter. I mean, it would look like the, the mayor is condoning drug use, and we are in a war against drugs, in case you haven't noticed. Is this the same war we've been fighting the last 40 years? Yep. How are we doing? Any day now. <laughs> Mike, you brought me in here by saying I could make some changes, and yet you uh, reject every proposal that I make. Politics is a game of base hits. You keep swinging for home runs. I've been here three weeks. I've put my name on my desk and switched the office to decaf. That's the sum total of my accomplishments. I'm drinking decaf. When did Mike hire you? About a month ago. And you're gay? Well, except for one night in college, but I was drunk. I'm not trying to pry. I was just wondering if being gay gets in the way of... What is your position here? Special assistant on minority affairs. And what exactly do you do? Apparently nothing. 